Orange County has been on a solid path upward for decades, and we have entered the year 2020, the year vision. Our destination was clear. We were on course towards becoming the experimental prototype community of tomorrow, envisioned by Walt Disney. Let us review where we started the journey. Our county and the region was lifting off. We had a record setting 75 million visitors coming to Orange County with a $70 billion economic impact. This made Orange County the most visited destination in North America. We ended 2019 in a full orbit, heading to a destination not seen before. As we rocketed into 2020, little did we know that an insidious virus was on the horizon and the entire world had to pay attention. The nation began hearing a word that would become part of our permanent vocabulary, coronavirus. The global pandemic has claimed over 100,000 lives in the United States and affected more than 2 million people, and its presence continues to be felt locally. The pandemic resulted in tens of thousands of Orange County residents being laid off with unemployment spiking at 16.5%. Our theme parks closed their doors for the longest period of time in their history. Our professional sports teams canceled their games, hotels shut down across the region, and 30 conventions were canceled at the Orange County Convention Center. As COVID began to spread, calls were made not only to our healthcare and public safety leaders, but weekly virtual conference calls were held between the leaders of Central Florida counties to come up with a unified response to protect all residents. Through it all, Orange County government went into overdrive to help our residents who lost their jobs. As more families found themselves out of work, Orange County was the first to offer crisis assistance to residents to bridge the gap until state or federal assistance was available. We didn't stop there. Orange County was among the first counties in Florida to receive $243 million from the Federal Coronavirus Aid, Relief, and Economic Security Act, or CARES Act. The CARES Act funds allowed us to be one of the first counties in Florida to distribute free personal protective equipment to help stop the spread of the virus. Orange County has handed out more than 5.5 million masks and 1.1 million bottles of hand sanitizers for free. We formed the Orange County Economic Recovery Task Force to help us sharpen our focus as we plan to reopen businesses. Fifty of the best and brightest minds in our community began meeting almost daily to come up with guidelines and a plan to reopen our county that was both sensible and safe. Our region has evolved in ways that have made us safer and stronger in how we do business how we have fun, and how we show we care for others. Today we are launching a regional campaign embraced by multiple Central Florida counties to provide a clear, consistent message for our community to unite for safety. Visit Orlando and the Orlando Economic Partnership with spearhead campaign efforts. As part of the process, we consulted with an advisory team of over 100 local, media, business, healthcare, and community leaders. The campaign called Safer, Stronger Together will be a call to action for each resident and business to do their part in making our community safer from COVID-19.